Okay, so starting a new file, so if any other files get corrupted, uh, my trip out here wasn't for nothing. Yeah, the memory card that got corrupted a few weeks ago, uh, that's been taken out of service, but uh, once, you, once that sort of thing happens, uh, you kind of get scared for life. So it's a 2003 Ford GT Mustang. Okay, we have a Pinto. I think I remember these things from my childhood. Looks like uh, way back when it would have uh, cost, and I'm trying to focus in on here, $5,095, brand new. So it's a 1976 Ford Pinto. So that's the year uh, Jimmy Carter would have been uh, elected president. Oh, I'm not yet, but I'm not doing this. Right, right, right. right. So it's a 1965 Ford Mustang, so 1965, that would have been the year of the uh, Lyndon Johnson signed the Voting Rights Act. Okay, all you judges, you should be uh, <laughs> coming on in and come on, John. To, uh, <laughs> this is 2019 Ford Mustang GT.
was made in 1965. It's a 2006 Mustang GT. Mark 832V Intec V8 LSC. So here we are, another Pinto. I would have known these as a kid in the 1970s. It's the owner of the Pinto. You have a car here too? Uh, no, no, I can't even change oil in a car. <laughs> you enjoy him though. Definitely take no one to take pictures of. Okay, so I think I got all the cars that were here as of about 1 p.m. So I'll do a quick 360 degree view. Okay. So not as many cars as last year, but it looks like we're fighting uh, this bad air quality issue and we're fighting some possible rain and fighting uh, road work on Michigan Ave where maybe people don't want uh, little rocks jumping up and damaging their vehicles. So, there we are. 